Picture this, you weren't even born yet. As a matter of fact, your mother wasn't even born yet. And yet when your grandmother was five months pregnant with your mother in her womb, you had already developed into a tiny microscopic cell inside of your mother's reproductive organs. That's right, you were once a part of three bodies in one. Three generations taking in the same sounds, the same sensations, the same stressors, and also the same love. Whatever was happening in your grandmother's world that was causing her stress was filtering stress-based hormones into her bloodstream that reached your mother and would have eventually reached you. Fast forward to when you're a kid. Your mother has a really rough day at work. When she comes home, you say, mom, can I please watch this show on TV? She screams at you with so much rage. She's in the nervous system response called fight mode. And so what do you do? You flee, you run to your room. Now your grandmother who happens to live with you both comes out of her room and she says, please stop yelling at that child that way. I'll do anything for you to stop. She's in fawn mode, people pleasing. Now you have three generations that used to coexist within each other who now cohabitate and trigger each other collectively. This is something I call the intergenerational nervous system. And you can learn about it more in my book, Break the Cycle. This tea is hot.